Hey guys, Sock here from Socky Tech, and in today's video, I want to talk about a brand new dark mode that is available in One UI 2.0 as a hidden setting and does some amazing things even beyond the regular dark mode. Now, real quick, I do want to show you something real quick. So, if I go to my display settings right here, okay. Now we're going to take a look at the regular dark mode. It's right here. This is One UI 2.0. And if I enable the dark mode, basically what happens is I get a black and white night theme that makes things easy on the eyes. And some of this dark mode actually trickles down to the system applications, such as the phone application. If I launch this, you got the uh, dark background. If I go to my messages application, as you can see, that's what we have. Okay, when I tap on this, we have the keyboard. And then if I go into my calculator, that's going to also have dark mode. But the problem is when I go to any application that is not a Samsung specific application, if I go to, uh, let's say, dictionary.com, it's not going to have the night mode. It's still going to be white. It's going to be bright. And again, if I go out from here and if I go into another application, let's just go to the uh, one of me, my banking applications here. Let's just tap on TD Bank right over here. Again, we don't have a dark mode right here. So what I'm going to show you guys today is how to enable the forced dark mode that makes dark mode available in all the apps that you have downloaded. So what you want to do is you want to go to your settings and you want to go all the way down, all right? Let me just uh, disable this for, for now. You want to go all the way down. You want to go to developer options. If you don't have this option, what you want to do to enable these is go to about phone, go to software information, and tap on the build number seven times. So you have to tap this seven times, and it's going to say developer mode is now active. So let me go back here. So it's right over here. Now, when I tap on this guy, I'm going to scroll down just a little bit, all right? And I'm going to look for the forced dark mode, which should be somewhere here. It's right over here. So I'm going to enable this. Nothing's going to happen, all right? Let's go back home, and let's go back into the actual settings. Go to display and enable dark mode this time. Now, again, everything I showed you before still applies. So if I go to my phone, boom. If I go to my messages, boom, all right? Now, if I go to my weather application, Look at that. I've got the dark mode all over the weather application as well, which is fantastic. If I go to my uh, dictionary application, I'm going to have dark mode on it as well with colors automatically adjusting so I can see them. But I do have the dark mode easy on the eyes look. If I go to finance, if I just go to uh, TD Bank again, now you're going to see a brand new dark mode as you can see right here. All right. Again, just one more example. If I tap on Citizens Bank, Right here, it's going to be dark mode. So this is absolutely uh, fantastic. So as you saw, what you have to do is you have to go to the settings, go into the developer options and enable the force dark mode. If you don't enable it, you just get the regular mode. If you enable it, you get a system-wide uh, mode that applies to every app that you have installed. Even things like shopping, Amazon.com, look at that. It's going to give me the dark mode. There we go fantastic all right so let me know what you guys think about this drop your comments down below if you have any questions concerns and for now guys i'll see you in the next video have a fantastic day all right all right so if you found this video useful make sure to subscribe to Saki tech by clicking that button and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time i upload a new video and if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech Online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.